Nas here, um, on my way to the flea market. So, um, on the good old Burlington Bristol Bridge, which uh, was just open and closed, but I missed it by literally like, I don't know, five minutes. So, dang it. I wish I woke up a little bit earlier. Would have given you guys a spectacle to observe. But uh, any hoozles, uh, on my way to the market, not selling anything, just picking up some things from my homeboy, uh, Brian, who has a YouTube channel, Big Dog's Treasure Chest, I think that's the name of your channel, um, I watch that channel, uh, he gave me a, a couple of texts the other day, and he's like, hey man, I have this Back to the Future thing, and I have that Back to the Future thing, um, and there's a couple other things that have to do with the doors and stuff like that. So uh, he was giving me incredible deals uh, on these things. He's he's a reseller. He uh, has a warehouse of like vintage toys and you know retro video games, Hot Wheels, whatever. But um, yeah, he he does you know like uh, the more vintagey things. Um. There's the Griswolds. <laughs> Awesome. Uh, so anyway, <clears throat> yeah, meeting up with Brian, uh, gonna get some stuff, also gonna meet up with uh, Matt. Uh, Matt, we need a better nickname for Matt, but anyway, uh, deer, deer killer Matt, he's a hunter, so. <laughs> All right guys, I am here. Um, just gonna go get a little parking done <laughs> and uh, get out there. Uh, oh, there they are. There's these two morose mofos. For you. Yeah, you did. You were like, oh, I want to make Nas happy. No, but I will tell you a secret. <laughs> I did this in a video, and a buddy of mine said, you need to hit Nas up. Oh. He loves the doors. I do. I am obsessed with the doors. Look at that Morrison Hotel. Now that box okay. is actually in uh no, it's not better. bad shape. Yeah. Cool, then, man. I, then when I got <laughs> home that night, this was on my back of my chair, <sighs> and... And you said, oh my god, I want it, but it's probably so expensive. And I'm like, you know what? This needs to go to you. <laughs> I've seen it at toy shows, man. So I gave, uh, it, yeah. I gave it to you for exactly what I paid for it. That's awesome, man. Okay? Nice. Yeah, you guys then, don't need to know and that. And then, <laughs> two days ago, some guy gave me a bunch of stuff. Oh, God. With a bunch of Star Wars cardboard cutouts in it. Uh, and this was in that's it. That's not Star Wars. What? Hey, sh <laughs> <laughs> So this was in it. It's got a little fraying down here at the bottom, but. Oh, yeah, that's all right. It's probably from the 80s. Yeah. I wonder so. if it was on, like, something or if there were actual legs, too. Maybe, like, like maybe a DVD or display. Maybe. The oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That is, that's just cool. On top of a DVD display or. Yeah. So. Uh. <laughs> so yeah, I yeah, wanted yeah, to yeah. make sure <laughs> this went to the right home. Dude, yeah, thank you. Yeah. Uh, I'll I'll make sure to make sure that this money goes into the right home, which is yeah, your pocket. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> it's all about that. All right, uh, I'll turn this off and uh, give him some drugs for this. All right. Would you look at that? The Timinator. Nah. Look at this thing. I haven't seen this in person yet. No. Yeah, I only saw like photos on Instagram. But yeah, that's crazy, man. I'm just so used to his red truck, man. <laughs> well, I got my blue truck and my hearse. Good. Brian's coming to set up next to you. I threw one of his bins on the table. Oh my god. Two for five, one eight. Okay, sweet. Two, four, five. 95% didn't make <laughs> Lamborghini. Trying to see if there's anything. Ah, come here, you. All the good stuff they don't make. 1979. That's kind of cool. <laughs> Matt's like, why did I point that out? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Matt bugs. You're, uh, you're Mr. Thanks. Hot Wheel. Yeah, I guess. I'm special enough to be called Hot Wheel. <laughs> Matchbox. Hot Wheel oh, Harry. That's, it's like a super fast BMW.
punk rock. 1982. Oh, let's see here. What was that at? Oh, yeah. If you know, if you ever see these school buses and you see like like school grates in there, um, the prison bars or whatever, those are the pricey ones. So always look at the windows. If you're a damn scalper, that's what. <laughs> Oh, you're talking new ones. Oh, no, no, even old ones. Any of those that you see, if you see, um, yeah, bars on there, just grab it, especially if it's the right price. I still have my childhood one of these. That's freaking cool. He's like, look at this one, Nas, and I'm taking it, sucker. <laughs> oh, man, now that's a fire truck. Come here, you. Holy bajili. Look at that thing. It's a hot wheel too. Another Shelby. French toast. <laughs> French toast crunch? What? Cinnamon toast crunch? No, it says French toast crunch. <laughs> Look at that. How weird is that? Huh. Alright. Um... It was two for five. I think there was one more I was into here somewhere. Ooh, what's that? Hong Kong. Oh, it's one of those, uh, you hit it and it looks oh, like it yeah, got hit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> ah, something like that. Mazda RX-7. Okay, moving on. <laughs> I'm over here at Ray's. I'm not showing you what Ray's doing. James is here too. <laughs> uh, but yeah, Ray Ray has this. It's like a solid metal, like everything solid on that. Nice. Uh, this guy was collecting uh, paperweight. I thought oh, it was a paperweight too. Okay. It could be like here. So papers are here. Five awesome. Dollars, uh, okay. Thank you. I'll see you in a little bit. Right. You want coffee or something? You sure? Five bucks. Not bad. Wish the clock wasn't busted. Up, you want to try buy your stuff? No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just following Matt around now at this point. <laughs> Some nice. Sometimes they come back for more. You never know. No. Sometimes. Sometimes, Sometimes they don't. They, they may with those right Oh, you're right. Okay. They probably come back for more. We'll make that movie. Will they Literary come back? Love company. This is why I hang with Nas. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> That's why everyone hangs with Nas. Hey man, what's up? See, we're all uh, in in uh, what do you call it? Misery. Master Jeet Kune Do concept and Filipino martial arts. Wing Chun dummy training. Wing Chun. More Wing Chun. Nice. You you get that deal, young man. Ah, oh, that's cool. Oh, I am totally not in. <laughs> Jackie Chan. Three for five. I'm just filming what you're flipping through. Oh, doing sure. my job for me. <laughs> uh -huh. In living color. <laughs> Okay. Great, that song's gonna be in my head now all day long. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Tim, this is all you? Yeah. Alright, cool. Oh, like, before I touch stuff. my house to wear. Good, man. I just cleaned out, like, a lot of my stuff. Just have a small Hot Wheel collection. That's why I got most of my stuff from Ethan. Oh, okay. Nice. What's, what's that? Oh, it's a pickup, okay. I feel the same way about mobile, how you feel about Sunoco. <laughs> Fair enough. <sighs> Watch out for that guy with the black hat, he starts trouble. Oh, I do, I do, all the time, man. What's up, man? <laughs> What's up, Zed? <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Me and Zed met where we almost, like, threw dukes at each other because I filmed them by accident. Yeah, you got upset with that. Yeah, then we became 
Who is that? Good friends. Yeah. <laughs> he that. He's just dead, man. That's sad, man. <laughs> he was fired up this morning. <laughs> really? Oh, he was fired oh, up. Yeah, he was wacky shit. Brad, he was off his rocker this morning. <laughs> I'm just, uh, I'm, I'm showing all of you because everyone's asking about all of you. Tim, freaking everybody. Oh, I, was, I thought someone was like gonna sneak up behind me. Uh, Steve, that guy that always buys everything for like way less. <laughs> I don't break for so. Uh, let me see. I know we're we're about to uh, keep going, but uh, so Mike's Mike here too, guys. I had to bring the weather. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Dino <laughs> Thunder, Mike. Yeah, there you go. Look at the Star Wars one. I know. He'll be here. Uh, there's only he's Scottish Mike here right now, so far. But yeah, like, we're over here at Big Dog's toy chest, yeah, and I'm looking at his big out? dog chest. But we're making it we sexy. Oh, you're looking okay. at my big dog. You ain't looking at my chest. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God! Oh. Yeah. Fantastic. Yes, folks, that's a machete. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> nice. Yeah, we're laughing because we saw that wheelchair without her, so we're like, oh my god. But yeah. Um, I mean, that's pretty cool. No, oh, look at that. Jaguar. Oh, can I have John Deere? <laughs> ah, there you go. <laughs> Ooh. Porsche. There's actually some good things in here. I'm surprised. Disney Transport. You want the Fargo police? <laughs> I want the Twin Peaks police. NYPD tow truck. That's cool. Visitor center. Isn't it really funny if the, the Barbie monster truck was in there? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There's a Tesla. The one that was uh, yeah. My nephew likes the Teslas. Wow, look at that. Yeah, this needs to be like dumped out. Man. Urban Outlaw. When's this from? Man. Derek, honest diecast if you're watching this. Let me see. Well, you know. You know how it go. Oh, guys, Monkey Corvette. That's cool. A little too short. Is there anything I need? I really don't need anything. You just sold all your <laughs> <laughs> Well, you know, is this Fast and Furious Hummer? It is. All right. Uh, that might be something. No. All right, the rest is, it's too foggy. <laughs> Nissan. <laughs> That's actually cool, man. I didn't even know that existed. See, I'd actually probably want that. That's the one. That's the one I'd want. That's cool. Nice. He might have it. <laughs> Are all your premiums different prices? Uh, yes. Okay. Oh, that's a treasure hunt right there. Oh, they're all treasure hunts. Probably most of them are from my collection. Yeah, this is the one I bought the other day. Just because I thought it was cool. Oh, yeah, it is. You want a yellow one? <laughs> no, I don't like the yellow one. I like the... I'm with you on that. Oh, jeez. That's Chevy Love. Nice. Oh, gosh. All right, let me ask. <laughs> because of Matt. <laughs> Keeps pointing things out. And getting in the sun too, because he's special. All right, beautiful. There's dollars, guys. Special. Well, look special. At that sun. Isn't that beautiful? 
I paid my rent for uh, January, and you get February for free. Nice. Oh, yeah, they're good people here. <laughs> they're okay. You know, the He's in love. Oh yes. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, huh. Brillo. Brillo. <laughs> oh man. SpongeBob. Nice. <laughs> there we go. Dude, you should grab that. There's yeah. so many SpongeBob collectors, it's not even funny. Okay, you know what? I so I already bought some kind of SpongeBob, but I have to get rid of them. It's SpongeBob sponges. Oh, sponges. that that's not something that anyone would think makes sense. Yeah. Um, it's, it's like too accurate, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. And you can't get rid of them. It's, right? it's on the nose. No, I just haven't done anything with it. <laughs> what are you getting on the the Pokemon Monopoly? Uh, it's incomplete, but it's a dollar for everything in there. Oh the heck box. yeah. What can you buy for a dollar? The box alone is going to be worth a dollar eventually. Heck yeah. yeah. Even just a collector can just put it on the wall. 50 cents, three for a dollar. Yeah, he said that when I was talking over him, so. <laughs> three for... If you see four. two other things you want, you go out because... I don't know. I have to leave. I hear you. I have to find, uh, what's his name, Speaking Aaron. about the naked gun. Nice. That was on the other day. Yes. Yeah, what's that orange tape? Look, this is like now? this is like the hospital slippers, but it's bud one. Nice. <laughs> uh, the orange uh, VHS. What is that? Rugrats. That's dude. That's uh. That's a good one. That's a good one. No, no, no. I'm serious. You should you should grab that if it's not ripped. It doesn't look ripped. Runaway rap Reptar. Hey. That's uh, orange tapes are rare. A lot of uh, collectors actually buy them so they can put like a Halloween movie into it. Alright, so now I got three. There you go. And... Oh my god, a whole dollar, man. You, ugh. Matt, <laughs> can, can you make it? <laughs> I actually do. No, I got a dollar. I was gonna <laughs> get ready. <laughs> no, Larry Bird. Yeah. Alright. Nice. Even Eric got something nice. I get the premium $3. So, um... <laughs> okay. Well, you're broke. Uh, all right. I can't be in here. And Pepsi. Oh, yeah. That, look, I'm sure there's a different magazine behind that. Because if you look at their expressions, it's fun times. <laughs> what is that? The hot sandwich guarantee. Oh, how cool is that? Yeah. I wonder what he wants for that. Right? Tim likes it Oh, yeah? Huh? Oh, Scott Scott? I know Tim. Yeah. Look at that. That's unique, too, because it's McDonald's and Snowco. Yeah. Guys, Eric's getting this for uh, for Tim. As a thank you for helping him out, too. So, yeah. Spreading that positivity. <laughs> well, now you have to baby that. Not <laughs> bend Oh, my God. Ah. Well, now you can't use your hand, either, so you're not going to buy anything else. That's the hope, but it hasn't stopped me before. Uh, back up or come closer. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> yeah, I was saying that to Matt. I don't think he realized that either. <laughs> I'm like, you're blocking my light. He's like, ha ha ha. Oh. Whoa. The good thing Don's oh. not here. He would have moved like more. <laughs> I know. Oh my god, I haven't like, seen oh, Don. You need, you need light? Oh, yeah. It's been a while. That's crazy. Yeah, he hasn't been coming for a long time. Is he okay? He's all right. It's weird too because he uh, he had some and like I didn't even remember and he's like you wanted this right and I was like oh yeah I did want that and it was nah. like months ago at <laughs> least he's honest yeah, yeah, let's check just... this out too what ooh five bucks there you go 
I figured you could use a hand. That's definitely not complete, but it's cool. That's just cool, yeah. What's this look like? That's cool. Cool board. Yeah, like someone should just frame that. That'll look amazing. Or a background for a 3D collage. <laughs> Yeah. I find all these interesting ones, and then it's just like, oh, now I gotta find a place to put them. Exactly. <laughs> That's why I'm selling stuff. I don't wanna find a place to put them. <laughs> Ooh. Yu Yu Kakusho. Remember Adult Swim? All right. Oh. I miss that. That's how I got introduced to uh, Cowboy Bebop and all those fantastic shows. Flash Gordon. The really high quality Power Rangers frisbee that is destroyed <laughs> in the packaging. The really high quality? <laughs> what the heck? Oh my oh, it's god. A kite? I know. It's a kite. It's a whole Power Rangers well, thing. Well, there's a, like a non destroyed one. Oh, okay. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> I'm not buying it. <laughs> this is the thing that you want. Are those. Oh, those action marbles? Yeah, they're. Or they're like balls or whatever. Like bouncy. They're flat, right? they're... No, it's a whole ball. Is it? Yeah. Kind of... I know people try to scalp just that. Is that what they, is that what they call them? You know, action marbles? I, I don't know. <laughs> That's cool. GoBots power suits. That's actually cool. What's funny electronic organ? That's cool, too. It's all cool. Raiders of the Lost Ark. Look at that. You can listen to it. And I guess it's like a little picture book. Oh, it's a record in there. Is it? What's it say? I don't know. It doesn't say anything. It doesn't say stereo. It doesn't say mono. Raiders cassette? album or cassette. Or cassette sealed. What? So even people selling it didn't know? <laughs> oh. Oh, man. Look at that. There's a Tatooine skip. Micro Machines. Japanese DS game. Quiz Magic Academy. Nice. In Japanese? Yeah, you'll win that one. Yeah, I know. The Beat Lace. Oh, man. Just look at that packaging. That's just great. That's cool. There's more Battlestar Galactica. <laughs> So much of it, yeah. Alright, I gotta show this for you guys. You gotta see the Hot Wheels. Well, I'll have to talk over this later since of the copyrighted Christmas music. Christmas was yesterday, guys. Look at that Mustang. Poor thing got destroyed. It's great stuff for customs, though. What do you got? Nice. The red halo. Eh. Oh look, it's a Stradivarius. We're rich. <laughs> Instant Pacific. Alright. See, no good deed goes unpunished. Eric Eric got that for Tim, and uh, now he has to walk around with it. It's a good thing we're almost done, though. I like this two-dimensional Xenomorph tag. Right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> the, the two they couldn't just put a Xenomorph figure in it. Nope. Eh. Whatever. Look at that beautiful Evil Knievel poster. It's nice. Mm. Thought that was Steven Seagal. <laughs> Ooh. Nice. Got kicked in the throat. <laughs> All right. Man, that generator is crazy loud. These are just cool. That's the thing why I like filming. I'm kind of window shopping. Technically, I bought it. It's it's recorded. <laughs> you make NFTs. Yeah, <laughs> I can exactly. Kill the environment. Buy NFTs. Watch out! 
Hey, how's it going? How's it going? Fire department. I just saw a bunch of cars. I figured I'd see what's in there. None of them are Hot Wheels, though. Oh, man, that's kind of cool. Fake Lamborghini. Yeah, with gold wing? No, they're not even gold wing doors. It almost looks like it would transform, but heck no, it does not. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right. Well, I'm good with that. Cop cars, yeah. All right. Blech. Okay, guys, I'm at a Hot Wheels Johnny's spot. Yeah. If you see any of them, grab two for me, all right? That's Hot Wheels Johnny, so uh, look out for him at Columbus. He has some fantastic stuff. I literally refrain from buying uh, any Hot Wheels until I get here. You see it, you'll see it. It's orange, right? Yeah. Don't you glint it off? Uh, you know, I haven't. I haven't, okay. no, I haven't, uh, I haven't seen it around. But yeah, I'm looking for, uh, you know, Lucy's uh, that I want to work on. And uh, premium castings to cannibalize for their wheels. <laughs> Jerry rigged. That's kind of cool. Yeah, some of these already were cannibalized. Nice Christmas Mustang. Yeah, those are all project cars. Faux show. I'm incognito. Look, guys, it's Hot Wheels Mike. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have any Hot Wheels. It's Hot Wheels Mike at uh, Star Wars Johnny's booth. So uh, yeah, it's look at this. He, he got a big old boat. He's gonna make sushi and serve it on that boat. It's a sushi boat, but I think it's gonna work for Mythic Legions very well. Oh heck yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh my you know gosh. I mean? That's why you should have a channel, it's showing off your job. stuff that you make. Like the stuff you set up is fantastic, dude. Yeah. Well, you know. Mike does it just for enjoyment, man. That's what it is. <laughs> Uh, but I want to share your. I want to live through you. Live through me. Vicariously. Yep. <laughs> Look at that. Mythic Legion's Bart. Oh, that's pretty cool. For Bart Simpson. <laughs> yeah. I wonder why. I wonder if it was a um, chess set. Simpsons oh, chess. Yeah. That's probably it. Nice. That's I cool. I think you got it. I have brain. Oh. I don't. I really don't. That's very Tonka. Look, it's all metal. Everything's metal. So, kid will toss this at your temple, and that's it. Listen, the trucks we used to play with when we were kids, those big metal ones with the sharp No one ever got killed. No, I have it's seen. Just, yeah, I've seen. Yeah, that's exactly what I was going to say. As far as we know, Mike. Uh, <laughs> there's always one kid. I mean, there's some special kids that came out of that. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> uh, so what are you looking for? What's your Ah, uh, right now I'm just looking for lines. No, not at all actually. <laughs> I found a couple nice ones earlier, but um at um I need to find red lines cuz we all played with those cars, you know. Everybody, yeah. When those came out everybody played with them. You don't hardly anybody put them away. No, no. Like yeah. today. You're That's why they're any, scuffed. You're not going to find any minty ones. Well, you will, but they'll be like $500 no, each. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. He's like, I saved this. I didn't play with it. Oh, it's an old toy store went out of business and somebody had the crate. Yeah. Them. Those are all like going away, though. Yeah. Well, how many could there be? Yeah. Yeah. And with all the internet now and everything. Before, without the internet, you have your honey hole and that was it. Exactly. Now everybody knows where it is. That's Radio crazy. flyer. Yeah, that's oh, we need the sun. Up, yeah. I'm surprised cool. you didn't go for this. Yeah, I mean... Like with the tow vehicle? Yeah. If it was one of those, like, 50s cars, yeah. I would have yeah, uh, customized that. Yeah, that's cool, too. Not for children under three. Oh, uh, well, I can't <laughs> use it. <laughs> All right, I'm just going to go for these. This is just... See, oh, that's... Oh, not anymore. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> I was... Well, that's what I was looking for. I was chassis. looking for if there's a chassis, yeah. But this is cool, but what am I going to do with it? It can be cool. It's pretty cool like it is. Yeah, but what am I going to do with it? It's plastic, right? Yeah, it's plastic. Yeah. 
It's first, yeah, like you said, it's a slot car. Yeah. Oh, well. All right, I think I should get like one more car here. Slot cars are cool. James can't stay away. <laughs> Back to this car. They come out with a clean version of this. Oh, man. Uh, I don't know. They probably did. Because it's so easy to put a scuff paint job on. I'm not saying they were trying to make money, but they're trying to make money. How do you know it's so easy, Mike? How do you know? <laughs> All right. Oh no, Skyline comeback. So you would have bought this in the past. I could do something with this. Yeah, I've had those in the past. I still have a couple in my little custom bucket. Yeah, there's really I'm trying to make it four, but I really don't. I'm only trying to get what I need. You know what I'm saying? So. Johnny didn't bring out his premium Lucy's. This one's just done. Hmm. All right, enough of that. Two skylines, and I really want to redo this one. Okay. You guys, returning to the video, it's Dave. <laughs> just run into him at the Hot Wheels Johnny's, so. Oh man. They're pretty cool stuff. You lie, Mike. Stop lying. <laughs> Where'd he go? <laughs> hmm. Five hours one So so maybe no more black series? I have I, I just ran across him. I don't know what Okay. Gotcha. Falcon. Falcon. Right, fellas, I'll see you. Oh, there you are. I was just looking for you. <laughs> oh, this sign blew over trying to get us. Oh, okay. You can't go without Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Problem solved. <laughs> Slap it on, man. <laughs> yeah. All right, well, Mike's leaving, so. All right, Merry Christmas, everyone. Good seeing you. Yeah, you know, happy old year. Yeah, happy, uh, you know, whatever. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> happy Festivus for the rest yeah, of us. Okay. I have some grievances with you people. <laughs> It's weird. What, what guys? It's me? Matt. Hey. <laughs> they ask about me. Uh, everyone, man. People just oh, miss yeah. miss all of you in the videos because I haven't been doing it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. See, oh, later, Mike. <laughs> you too. Good seeing you. It's been a while. I'll probably be more Sundays. Warm me too. No more setting up. I'm just gonna be hanging out. Yeah. I'm gonna do like all flea market tour, man. <laughs> Everywhere. <laughs> Later. After, uh, a friend of mine, Matt, was just at Berlin. He posted on there that it's, it's empty. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. Good. Good. I'm glad I'm here. Four. What? A, what? What? A, what? A, what? A, what? Four by four. We spell out one four, and the other four is a number. Wow. So four X they number. They voted for Trump. <laughs> <laughs> All right, brother. Talk to you later. <laughs> oh man, what's up? What's up, bro? You set up? Good. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, we're set up. We're over there. Nice, nice. Oh, ah! I was in the Berlin and he said, he took a... So like, they're dead. Yeah, that looks freaking... That's nice phone, man. Oh, thank you. Hey. Whatever, man. What? A Mercedes. All right, people out there in Nas land. Yeah, and well, no, that's not my land. In you YouTube land. <laughs> you're Nas too. There, see, I'm next to him. Yeah, I'm here. We work out. Yeah. Oh, let's go eat salad. All right, yeah, let's go eat some salad. <laughs> Toss. All right. Uh, almost done. I walked everything through. Uh, sadly, Matt had to go sooner. I uh, walked around with Eric. And uh, yeah, let's see what else they got. Yeah. Well, he was interested in it too. Thank you. That's cool. For me, Energizer Bunny is super nostalgic.
there's a mask. Oh, it lights up. I guess it's like that movie, whatever. The Purge. Where everyone has to go to the bathroom really quick to purge themselves of their poo. Oh god. I know that guy. <laughs> if you're watching, shout it. Busy with customers over there. I shall crush your head. Oh, crushed. Hit me up, man. Alright, guys. I am leaving. I got way too much stuff to do. I actually didn't realize. Um, yeah, I had to like literally just run into my car and get out of here. <sighs> All right, so um, what a good morning, man. It was really cool uh, catching up with some of the guys, uh, hunting with some of the guys, and uh, just, just hanging out, honestly. Um, I wish I had more time today. Uh, but yeah, sadly I don't. But I am excited about that. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> Talking about I'm out of time. <laughs> Did I just make a thumbnail? Did I just hit a tree? I didn't hit a tree, but I think I'm in a freaking flood zone. Jeez. Splishy splashies. Oh gosh. All right, guys. There's uh, J Row, I believe they call it. I call it the sock because it's uh, one one lane in the end and it's shaped like a sock. All right, I'm done. <laughs> All right, um, I'll have to, for some of you newer guys, I'll have to one day go into the inside part. Uh, I will go to the inside part soon because, uh, you know, winter's coming. You don't feel that today. Today it's freaking 50 degrees out and uh, it's uh, the day after Christmas. So how crazy is that? So, uh, but yeah, uh, it's gonna be a good day. People are piling in. Um, but uh, yeah, it's really good to, free again, it's so nice to just go to the market and not have to sell or set up. Like, uh, I know I keep saying that, but you guys need to understand how freaking tired I got of being a, a vendor at the market. Uh, yeah, it's uh, after you do it for a few years. I was successful, don't get me wrong. I was doing great every time. But uh, it just becomes it becomes a job, man, and it takes your weekends away. So it's it's fun to just go to the market once in a while to buy some stuff, or once in a once in a while sell stuff that you're you know minimizing or whatever. So, uh, but yeah, enough about all that. Um, big dog, dude, thank you for that. He gave me an amazing deal. Uh, if you wanted what all this stuff is worth, like this and that flag, and. Uh, other stuff that I can't see, the Jim Morrison thing. Um, yeah, he, he really he really hooked me up with this stuff. So thank you, Brian. Uh, you rock. And you guys, check out freaking, check out this channel, man. Like, the man has a warehouse full of toys. He has a store, which I'm going to go to soon to make a video about it. So, uh, yeah, keep an eye out for that. Brian, I need a t-shirt for doing that for you. <laughs> But yeah, we need to uh, get Brian's channel to get better. So uh, if you guys can, any of you that can, head over to uh, Big Dog's Toy Chest. Or is it Big Dog's Treasure Chest? Anyway, read right here under my mouth. <laughs> Go to Big Dog's freaking YouTube channel, guys. Leave him a message. Subscribe to his channel, if you don't mind. Uh, he needs a little bit of a boost. He's a good guy, generous guy always looks out for all of us in the toy collecting community and you know diecast too he has a lot of diecast and uh, hot wheels in his store as well so um i'm really looking forward to going to that store uh sometime this winter uh, because you know flea markets are not going to be really necessarily open so i'll have to uh make you guys some new content to watch so but yeah, uh, please go to uh, Brian's channel, uh, subscribe to him, leave him a comment, you know, tell him like, hey man, you know, uh, Nas was talking about you, I'm over here. Uh, if you like his channel, tell him that. If you don't like his channel, be like, hey, I'm disappointed in your channel. <laughs> don't do that, but you know, um, anyway, just uh, trying to uh, share the love, try to support fellow collectors and uh, people in the business or whatever that help and provide product to other collectors 
And people like him should get a little boost just because, you know, he looks out for people, man. Like, he provides things for a lot of friends that I have. They buy from him or trade with him. So, um, yeah, you know, give him some love, man. You know me. I always try to uh, help out smaller channels, uh, especially of good people. So he's one of those. So definitely hit him up. All right, guys. So I'm here at uh, this putt-putt or drive-in range you know for golf stuff but i'm gonna show you my pickups you know like that board and everything else that i got so uh just figure i'd do it now because i don't really have the space in my house right now like set up to look nice so i'll just do this at the end of this video so you can see the pickups because for some reason videos that just have the pickups just the pickups video they don't do well at all people just watch like let's say 2,000 people will watch the flea market video maybe 300 will watch the pickups video so i'm like i'll just leave it in the flea market video or don't even show you the pickups because most people aren't gonna watch till the end anyway so if you watch till the end you get to watch the pickups so let's uh let's show you the stuff Whoa. all right let's start climbing okay so obviously this amazing cutout um i can't even understand how it's preserved so well uh, so yeah, this is gonna definitely have a centerpiece in my collection Maybe I'll even figure out something to do with the bottom there Maybe put like a something frame that I got from certain Hot Wheels homies right under there But uh, yeah, how cool is that guys? Let's zoom out a little. There we go Freaking love that. I can't believe that I'm gonna have one now. Big dog. Thank you, Brian uh, Then we have this also from Brian uh, we did kind of a trade, but he really hooked me up, like I was saying earlier. Um, there's no way I would have traded or bought any of this if, if it was like uh, like convention prices, you know what I mean? He, gave, he uh, well, traded or sold this to me for um, whatever. It wasn't $50. Last time I was at a con, uh, someone was selling these. Well, they had one. And dude was uh, asking 50 and I think he had finally sold one, sold it for $40 by the end of the show. So, um, Brian, thank you, bro. Uh, this is going to freaking, again, this is perfect for my collection. I can't believe it. And also from Brian, the last thing, this fantastic freaking Morrison Hotel. What is this, a Camaro, I believe? Does it say what car there it is? It just says adult collectible. It's from Racing Champions. Um, I think it looks like a Camaro. Pete, let me know. <laughs> but yeah, uh, Morrison Hotel is uh, one of my absolute favorite albums of all time, really. But uh, the Doors album itself from their library, this is great too. So, um, but yeah. I don't know, this is great. Uh, pretty much it's it's going to stay in the box. It's, it's like a whole thing, you know. Uh, even though that looks amazing, the car looks amazing. I'll just clean it up a little bit but it'll look good this way just on display some things don't need to be opened up <laughs> they kind of they kind of work together you know what i mean all right oh, let me sit back down here and i'll show you all the loose hot wheels that i picked up from all the different vendors let me uh put the camera up on the dashboard <laughs> all right i think that works i don't know there's a bunch of stuff so hopefully uh you guys have a couple minutes uh, I'll try to remember who I got what from. This was uh, the first piece I picked up from a gentleman that only had one car on his uh, list. It's a piece of fence with it. But uh, the windshield is actually not even broken. It just came out of its uh, little track, which I'm putting it right back in there now. Watch me break it. <laughs> but now I'll, I'll fix the windshield later. But uh, look at that. The windshield's fine. There's uh, little tracks you can see in there. I just have to uh, slide that back in there. So it's not even broken. But yeah, this is, uh, I believe, Alfa Romeo. It's a Roadmaster's Flyer Supercar. Alfa Romeo Spider scale model. So the trunk opens. The, the hood opens. As you can see there. The windshield falls off. <laughs> But uh, I just thought this was just a good-looking car. I think it's neat. Uh, what year? 
Lone Star made in England. Uh, doesn't say the year, but I'm pretty sure this is like a 80s, 70s situation. Whatever it is, I think I paid a dollar for it, so, you know. You know what I'm saying? What can you get for a dollar? All right, next up. Uh, this was also a dollar on a lady's table. Uh, the stick the sticker says ND500 number 86 for $3. I paid $1. I just thought it looked good. Hopefully you, you think so as well. I don't know if, yeah. I think it's pretty cool. Big old special 620 price. Ooh, Mythic uh, Customs just posted a video. But yeah, 1984, so pretty cool. Okay, next we have, ah, this I got from Ray, uh, this I'm kind of excited about, Ray's a good friend of mine as well, so he definitely gave me a first cousin price, it's a paperweight, the whole thing's solid metal, like there's no, you know, this is like, <laughs> but yeah, really cool, uh, it's a clock, you know, digital, but you know, the screen's messed up, see there's leakage going on. Which isn't a big deal. For what I paid for it, it doesn't matter. Uh, I just thought this was neat. Um, let's see. Where's the little... Kind of curious what it is. Ah. <laughs> Limited warranty, okay. You're a recipient of a fine quartz clock desk set featuring the very latest contemporary design and highest quality quartz clock module. Blah, blah, blah. So this was like a mail-in thing. It tells you how to set the clock, whatever, limited warranty. The box is fancy. And this is ALC Raft or AL Craft, innovative products crafted in aluminum. Ah, they make calculators and stuff. Design my okay. That's really cool, man. So yeah, this was like an advertisement thing that I guess was given to people that were selling stuff. But there you go, Exxon. Our favorite uh, ocean polluter. <laughs> Remember the Exxon spill? Never forget. So, okay, next. This was also from my boy Ray. This is a Matchbox Super Fast. It's a Carter Camaro Z28. A uh, very, very cool looking car. This will go up either for trade or for something later. But uh, yeah. Like I said in the beginning of the video, guys, uh, I only had a $20, uh, you know, uh, freaking budget to, to work with today. And I actually still have uh, six bucks in my pocket. Six or four, I don't remember. Um, but yeah. All right. Got this bone shaker right here i don't collect bone shakers necessarily but when i see one that's cool and if it's like 50 cents like this one was i grab it so that was a 50 cent one uh this was from a uh, hot wheels johnny a uh, really cool guy i believe him and his uh wife uh, are running that spot this is going to be a custom so but yeah, he's a good dude. Always hooks me up. I got a bunch of JDM stuff from him. I'm trying to pick those out here. Love that little freaking skyline right there. Uh, yeah, Hot Wheels Johnny sold me all these for a dollar a piece. Which is, you know, fair enough. Got that, that, that. Got those three. Oh my god. Got another one of these also from, from him. Okay. Alright. I think that's it from Hot Wheels Johnny. Uh, oh no, 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 no. It's not. Uh, also got another one of these. Same one as I just showed you. These are for customs. You can never get enough of these uh, donor bodies. 
All right, then I moved on and got this Aston Martin DB5. I believe it's in British green. He had another one that was silver, the typical color that they sell them in. But this green one caught my eye, so I don't know. It's um, twenty thirteen, so twenty fourteen. Uh, this came out, but really beautiful car, man. I love Aston Martins; they're just fantastic. Love them, love them, love them. Just like the cars. And this thing, uh, Mustang Hunter Jason showed uh, him getting one of these at a show that he had to go back for because someone told him that it's actually a Mustang. So uh, whenever me and him are going to trade or whatever, I'm going to send this to him if he doesn't have it. So Jason, let me know if you don't have this. Uh, I will happily send you this Mach 1. It's in great condition, man, as you can tell. No, like, no scuffs or anything. Everything opens up good. The wheels aren't bent. The wheels are in great condition. So, yeah, really cool car. Matchbox, it's a... Uh, 1983 so yeah really cool man I, I think the deco on this is great it's lovely so yeah jason let me know if you need this if you need it it's yours if you don't then it's mine <laughs> all right uh okay cool so ah so when i got the thing um what you call it uh the aston martin he also had this he was selling uh Two for three dollars, I guess. Anyway, this thing's a mess. It's an old uh, Lesney, right? I'm trying to see. Matchbox series number 42. Studebaker. Lark Wagoneer. Made in England by Lesney, yeah. So, this is really cool. I just watched, uh, well, not just. A few years ago, I watched Bare Metal uh, HW or bare metal Hot Wheels, uh, restore one of these. And I think he was looking for this top piece that's hard to find because it breaks or, uh, you know, it either breaks or, or it breaks off. <laughs> this one has it. So I'm actually going to also restore this car because I think this is just the beautiful casting. I like it a lot. I'll pop some, uh, nice wheels on it and keep it in my collection like all the glass windows everything looks good the windshield's good it has the thing so i'm happy with this so really cool not in good condition but you know i like restoring stuff so i will restore that and last but not least i never thought that i would find this car again in the wild uh this is the first car that i was gonna surprise dotson man diecast this was probably a year or two ago um, and, um, I was making him a custom. I wanted to, uh, polish it up and powder coat it. But when I was polishing it up, it got caught in the polishing wheel and it got shot across the floor, twisting the body. Um, I sent that to him and he straightened it out and he fixed it. He definitely had way more experience with doing that. So he did that, but it's a Hot Wheels Datsun 200 SX from 1981. So uh, look at this beautiful car. So this bad boy I'm keeping in the collection. Um, unless Mark wants it, then I'll just give it to him. <laughs> but uh, oop, now I broke it again, no. But uh, yeah, there you go. The uh, hood opens. It's just really cool casting, man. And it's, you know, like 40 years old almost. It's as, as old as me, man. Really beautiful Datsun. So yeah, I'm definitely on the lookout for these. It has a metal base. As you can see, Hot Wheels right there. Really cool. Oh no. So yeah, I was really stoked to find this. And uh, yeah, as soon as I saw this in the bin, I was like, that's that's going with me. So uh, definitely going to restore this also. Probably paint it up again. And um, yeah, we'll see what happens. But I am going to look for more of these because I really need to follow through and send Mark one that um, I intended to customize it the way I wanted to. Probably not powder coated. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep powder coating. But uh, we'll see how that goes after the New Year's. I'll have to talk to the guys that I work with there. So we'll see. But yeah, awesome, awesome Dotson. Really happy to find this. 
the one that I freaking stripped for Mark, it was actually in way better condition. The paint was good. I kind of regretted doing that, but, uh, you know, that I stripped the paint. Um, not that I gave it to Mark. <laughs> Mark can have anything he sees, man. Uh, so, yeah. Really love that. There you go. Um, I think, I believe that's it. I might have put something in one of these smaller pockets. Let me double check. Can't leave you guys hanging. <laughs> All right. Oh, boy. One sec. Yeah, there you go, guys. There's the haul. Really awesome cars. Really awesome stuff here. Again, didn't pay, I paid less than 20 bucks for all of this, and that's how I like to do flea markets. Uh, you want to walk away with the best deals you can find, and uh, with the rarest things you see. Hook up your friends, hook up your um, custom pile, and uh, yeah, and a couple things for the collection. <laughs> so yeah, I'm probably going to keep, uh, we'll see how the condition is, but definitely one of those is going to stay in the collection in my loose collection even though they're not premiums but they're castings i collect yeah this one's in great shape still shiny so but yeah really productive freaking haul really awesome stuff i'm really happy with everything i got with the trades with big dog and all these things so yeah all right guys that's it for me uh i'm done i'm gonna pack up all this stuff and get out of this uh golfing range before they call the cops on me and tell me why is there a 41 year old man in his car alone uh playing with hot wheels that's that's pretty weird right oh my god yeah i gotta get out of here uh yeah so yeah thanks guys for watching i hope you enjoyed this episode of flea market days uh which is again i'm reminding you is a series that's back uh, I plan to keep going to uh, Columbus Market whenever I do go, just to walk around, hang out with friends, hunt with friends. Um, I also plan on going to a whole bunch of other flea markets that are uh, in the area, in the Northeast area. So I'll be going to New York, I'll be going to a bunch of other ones that are local. I have at least four or five, yeah, at least five or more flea markets that are within within an hour, so under an hour. I can go to all those different flea markets. I'm, I'm very blessed with that. Not blessed with money. That's why I'm just going to have $20 uh, budgets and uh, try not to uh, spend more than that unless it's something that's like necessary or needed. So you know how I do, guys. Uh, no more uh, hoarding. It's just intentional collecting, intentional buying. And uh, yeah, uh, not as much selfishness going on anymore. So Anyway, uh, good seeing everyone at the market that saw me, that talked to me. Uh, you guys are awesome. Um, hopefully, we'll get awesomer in the future. But uh, for now, I'm signing out. Live long and prosper. Don't be assholes. And remember, I'm an asshole. <laughs> Bye.